Hi everybody, this is the teach for a Hot Rhythm Cha Cha. So I'm just going to turn around so you can see what my feet are doing. And we're starting on the right foot. I'm tapping my heel four times, my right heel, but I'm only snapping my fingers twice. So I'm doing a tap and then a pause with my hands and a snap and then another pause and a snap. So it looks like this. The foot is actually going double time and I'm going one, two, three, four. So I'm basically snapping on one and three. One, two, three, four. If you were to look at it from the front, I have both my arms over to the right hand side. So it looks like this. One, two, three, four. Both going in the same direction. Then I'm going to do four slaves starting to the right. Right, left, right, left. When I do the sways, all I do is just switch my weight back and forth between my right foot and my left foot. So basically I'm walking. If you walk forward and you leave your toes attached to the ground, and just lift your heels. So it's walk, 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 walk. And when I walk like this, and I only lift my heels, then I get a little bit of a sway with my hips. So I'm not picking my toes up at all. So we do four taps onto the right leg and four sways starting on the right hand side. That's section one, that's your first eight counts. So it goes one, two, three, four, sway, 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 sway. And then we would do exactly the same on the left hand side. And that would be your second section. One, two, three, four, sway, 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 sway. And my hands are going the same direction that my leg is tapping. So starting on the right hand side, one, two, three, four, sway, 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 sway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Those are your first two sections. Section three starts with a Monterey turn. I only do the first half of a Monterey turn and I finish it with a Mambo step. So instead of going out and in and out and together, I'm going out and in with the quarter turn, Mambo left. Okay? So it's the first half of a Monterey turn, which is pointing out to the side. Then bring your right leg back in to return it to its center position and do a quarter turn at the same time. So this is one and that's two. Mambo step would be three and four. Three and four. Two more Mambo steps. One on the right leg and one on the left. Five and six, seven and eight. So again, that section will be one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Next section starts with a double scuff forward. If you have the leather, leather type of shoes that slide, you can do your scuff by touching the ground. If you have running shoes on or something that sticks, you can do your scuff a little bit in the air. And that way you won't stick and trip. So it's scuff forward and back and forward and back, and it's very rapid. So it's and one, then two. Okay? And one, then two, step, tap on the right leg. And one, and two. Step with the right, tap with the left. Take a big step to the side with the left leg. Step to the side and drag the right one in and go stomp, stomp. I'm just going to face this wall so you can see what my feet are doing for that section. But I'm um, uh, a quarter turn to the right when I'm doing it. So it would be and one and two, step, tap, big step, drag, don't stop. And if I count it, and one and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? But I've done a quarter turn. I'm actually 
facing the wall a quarter to the right when I'm doing that step. And one, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we're going to do a series of steps backing up. And then we're going to come back forward and start the dance on the three o'clock wall. So the dance is rotating clockwise. So the backing up steps, I tried to make it as clear as I could in the step sheet. And it's good that you're watching me from the side because that's the easiest to see the demo. I'm tapping my foot and then I do a hitch. So I'm tapping it a little bit in front, not way in front, just a little bit in front so that it's comfortable. And a small hitch, not a great big huge hitch. Tap it in front with a small hitch. Go up and down on your heel, almost like a little hop. One and two. Step back. One and two. Did you see my left heel raise and lower when I hitch? One and two. Stepping back is two. Walk, walk. One and two, three, four. Now change legs. Five and six, seven, eight. So it's kind of like a little mini hop there. One and two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight. So that would be section five. Section six is pointing your right leg out to the side and then walking forward three times. When I point my leg out to the side, I do a little bit of a dip with it. So it's out to the side, walk, walk, walk. Same thing on the left. Out to the side, walk, walk, walk. So I backed up with those funny little hopping steps and then I've come forward with the walk to return myself to a home position on the three o'clock wall. Counting that from back here would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then I'm ready to start the dance at the three o'clock wall. So that's the whole